Well, Phoenix is the kidnapping capital of America. The problem tonight, police administrators are going to send a group of detectives that were dedicated to this major public safety issue back to patrol. The CBS 5 promise. We're telling it like it is, and Peter Bush is live outside police headquarters. Peter? Yeah, we first told you about these specialty squads a couple weeks ago. Now, the career criminal squad, they're going to remain intact thanks to public pressure. But there's another group of detectives. They work with serious stuff like home invasions and kidnappings. They did not make the cut. So you take this vital work that has a positive impact on the Hispanic community, and you penny wise, pound foolish, and you cut it. Mark Spencer is the president of the Union for Phoenix Police Officers. He says the people running drop houses and smuggling rings are the worst of the worst in the valley right now. And he thinks it's a big mistake to get rid of this violent criminal syndicate crime suppression unit. They specialize in going after those crimes that mostly affect heavily Hispanic parts of Phoenix. I mean, what kind of message does that send uh, to, to uh, th that minority community, the Hispanic community in, in the city, city of Phoenix? I, I think it clearly sends a message, maybe they're not that important, and that's a shame, and that is absolutely unacceptable. Now, the five detectives from that specific unit, they'll get reassigned, mostly go back to patrol. Now, a Phoenix police and spokesperson told, told us a couple weeks ago, when we first started looking into this, that other detectives will try and pick up the slack for those other important cases like home invasions. Reporting live, Peter Bush, CBS 5 News. Yeah, still a big problem. Thanks, Peter.